All right, watch fans, I got another. This is an old one that I haven't put up in a while. Um, I got this with one of the $52 tier one wheel spins on Watch Gang. I have a feeling based on the size, I think I know what it is. I think it's one of those three league watches, which is a very low budget brand. So I probably won't be too excited with it, but I'm gonna review it. Um, if it's the same color, that's the last one I had, then I'm just going to, uh, yep, Three Leagues watches, made in China also. Um, it is definitely a low-budget watch, but hopefully it'll be a different, more unique color. Oh, not bad. Actually, you know what? I really like this color combination. I think I'm okay with this one. The last one I had, which I'll put a picture up here, wasn't totally thrilled. You know, it's decent looking, but uh, it just wasn't wasn't for me. Um, but this one's not bad. Um, wow, all right. I'm, I'm kind of pleased with that. Uh, I'll just get right into it. No point in making this video longer than it needs to be. Um, this has a Ronda movement. It is a Swiss part, so it is actually a Swiss movement, but it is uh, the Swiss movement is is a lower lower budget version uh three jewels i think it is swiss parched um not bad uh this watch strap is actually quite nice it feels really good um i would say it's probably one of the nicer things about this watch it's not it's not necessarily a really high budget probably about a 20 25 leather strap uh from ebay but i really like this one much better than the black one um it just has a nicer feel and um I think it goes better with the watch. I like the Pepsi, Pepsi look. You can kind of see. I'm gonna leave this on because um, I'm probably gonna sell it or just give it away to a friend. Um, you know, date, time. Let me pull that out just so you can see it move. I'm sorry. Oh man. Hmm. Jeez. I can't believe I can't get this off. <laughs> this is crazy. This should be like really easy to just like pull off. Like, what am I doing wrong? My God. All right. Lord, this is driving me nuts. I cannot believe this. Here we go. All right. Oh, sorry. Okay. There it works. Ticking. Yay. It's nice. Uh, logo is on the clasp. Kind of off center, but it's what it is. There's one on the back. Uh, one on the crown. And one on the face. And also there. So, you know, it's what it is. Um... 60 clicks all the way around 360 degrees um standard hardened mineral crystal uh this is not 316 sand steel i don't know what it is but it's it's uh definitely a cast steel you can kind of see and it's just been deburred um not bad 50 uh meter water resist uh 5 atm uh, which is not bad it's it's what it is um you know, the other one, I just didn't really like the look, but I have to say, for about $50, you really can't go too wrong with this. I mean, I could get a used watch that's nicer, but honestly, for $50, this is not that bad. Um, I mean, I should really question what I was expecting for $50, right? Um, I guess I was expecting to hit the higher tiers, but this is one of the one tiers that I hit, and it's what it is. So, but there you have it. I'm not even going to put a video, so um, just a quick short. All right, uh, if you like this video, please give a thumbs up. Um, and if you want to see more quick reviews like this, let me know in the comments. Otherwise, I, I'll make my usual 13-minute ones. All right, thank you very much.